Okay, Mother's Day shopping. Um, I've got $75 to spend from, you know, all my Mother's Day monies. Uh, we're going to Hobby Lobby, 30% off. This is like the third week in a row they've had 30% off, but I'm excited about it. We've got the kiddo, so we're gonna go get some yarn. Okay, so Hobby Lobby trip was a huge success. I set myself the $75 limit, spent $77 and like 58 cents after tax. Two big bags in the floor. So I feel like it was successful and I can't wait to get home and show you guys everything that I got. Okay guys, I have made it home with my Hobby Lobby trip. It did stop. Uh, the restaurants are open back up here at 50% capacity. They're keeping people 12 feet apart while eating. So my daughter and I stopped and got some Mexican food. Um, and now I'm home. So I'm going to open some stuff. And this is my wine punch. It's, um, I don't even know, some local craft fair thing. It's like a mix and you mix it with wine and water. So this is 50-50 wine and water plus flavoring. Tastes really good. All right, so as you saw um, just a second ago, I set myself a $75 limit, spent $77. So I got my receipt here too, so I can share all that stuff with you. Okay. <sighs> all right, so there's a lot of this yarn I got like two skeins or cakes or whatever of two different things. Well, one of each, but two. Okay. Anyways, let me just show you. So I got this. I love this yarn. It is very, very, very soft. Um, way, way better deal than Super Saver, in my opinion, just because of how soft it is. Um, this is 100% acrylic, 355 yards, seven ounces, medium number four, calls for a five and a half millimeter hook um, or five millimeter needles. It is machine washable. You can also machine dry. Do not iron. Those are the only symbols I know. But anyways, I got this specifically to run alongside this. So I will, hold on, let me like, this is a mess. This is a whole mess. I don't, it's all connected. Hold on. Oh golly. Okay. Okay. All right. Here we go. Oh, I had a yarn spill and part of it was just me being a dingleberry. Okay. Anyways, I got Feeling Gradient and this beautiful green and blue. The green is what drew me in, but I'm going to hold them together. Don't know what I'm going to make yet. I have 590 yards of this, um, and I only have 355 of this. So I probably should have got two. Oopsies. That's okay. I met my limit. So, whoops. There's that. Um, okay, I got two of these because I just thought it was gorgeous. I'm probably going to make like a hat and scarf set. Um, I'm going to have to turn into somebody that wears hats because I usually don't. So I'm going to have to do something about that so that I can use this yarn for a good reason. I got Katarina Tangotopia. Here's the colors. Oh, is it not just gorgeous? Look at this side. It's even more beautiful. Oh. Okay, anyways, Katarina Tingotopia. Um, oh, you know what? The I Love This Yarn was on sale. Normal price, $4.99. Got it for $3.49. Okay. I got this wonderfully fluffy whatever you want to call this. Um, normal price $6.99. I got it for 
Oh no. Six ninety nine minus oh four dollars and eighty nine cents. This is four eighty nine. This three dollars ninety nine cents. Two seventy nine each. For so two seventy nine per scheme. Um, I got this because I just absolutely love the colors. I have no idea what I'm going to make with it. Um, this is the Yarn Bee Pigment and Fiber. Colorway is City Girl. 630 total yards. So that's quite a bit. I can do something, you know, decent with that. Granted, this is a three weight. I'm sorry. I don't know why I said three. This is a one weight. You know, this is actually a pretty thick one. Um, I'll probably make some sort of lacy scarf, fashion scarf. Um, I don't know, but anyways, 630 yards total, 5.2 ounces, it's 60% acrylic, 20% wool, which is why I got it, because it had a wool content. Um, and I'm just, I'm really into the more natural fibers. Um, I, I'll buy acrylic, but I'm really liking cotton. I'm really liking um, wools. I'm mean, even nylon, which I know is man-made, but it behaves like a natural fiber a little bit more. Also, um, yeah, yeah, this is also 20% nylon. So I think these colors are gorgeous, like just absolutely beautiful. So this was $7.99 regular, and I got it for $5.59. I probably would not have gotten it if it was not on sale. Okay, now this I got specifically to hold with this. I just, I won't ever do anything with this as a solid. Um, it's not my kind of color. So I'm going to hold two strands together, one strand of this, one strand of this. Um, this is Soft and Sleek DK, and this color is, oh, I don't even know. Oh, linen. So this color is linen, and I'm going to hold it with this. This is also a three weight. Um, so both of these together. I think it'll make something really pretty. Um, and I did get two of these specifically so I'd had an, because this is 600 yards. So these right here are 478 yards. So I got two. I'll have quite a bit left over, which is fine. But both of these are number three weights. Um, the purple and this gray. I just really like this gray. Look at that. It's so pretty. And this is a 100% low pill acrylic. Um, oh, hold on, I'm getting a phone call. I missed the call. Anyways, so yeah, these were $4.99 a piece originally. I got them for $3.49 a piece. Um, this next one I am really excited about because I've seen a lot of good stuff about it, but I never fit the bullet and got it. So, I've decided to get it. I got Arabella um, and Seabreeze. So, as you can see, pretty much the full transition of colors here. That's why I got these two balls specifically. Um, so, this, like I said, is Arabella. It is a five weight. I would, I mean, it's a light five. I would even almost act like it's a four. Like, when I use it, I might use a hook that would be called for a four normally. 55% cotton, 45% acrylic. Calls for a 6.5 millimeter crochet hook, 5.5 millimeter knitting needles. Uh, 105 yards. I was going to get all four because they were all matching dye lots. But I decided I was just going to get two and make something small. Like, maybe a hat. I just want to see if I like it. And then, you know, if I want to do a full project with it in the future, I will. So, those $4.99 originally got them for $3.49 today. 
Um, next, I just got a bunch of colors of I Love This Cotton because I found some washcloths that I'm going to do. And they're watermelon washcloths. And they're so cute. Um, I have the pattern downloaded, but I don't remember where I found it. I'll just... I'll put the name of the pattern below in the comments, and then you guys, if you feel like searching for it, you can search for it. Beautiful stuff. Um, so these are the colors I got for the watermelon washcloths, and I love this cotton. Seeds, obviously, the watermelon colors, and then this is just an accent that the pattern calls for. Um, it wants white too, so I got two of these, and one of this, and one of the black. I really needed two whites, but they only had one, so I got one. So, there's one bag. Yeah, another bag. Um, let me hang these back up really quick here. Okay. Bag number two, which houses my daughter's yarn. Which I so kindly bought with my Mother's Day money because I love my child. I did give her grief about it though. Oh, I got a yarn ball holder too. Really good. Okay, so here's my ball holder. Isn't it so cute? I wanted a sizable one. I was going to get the llama one, but it was just too small because they didn't have a big one. I've seen some, 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 some. Some Hobby Lobbies have where like the llama one is about this big, but mine is like the size of that inner circle in there, if you can see that. So I didn't want to get one that small. Okay, yep, the rest of this yarn I got to make something for my daughter. Um, we got two of these sparkly white I Love This yarn, and... I will be holding this together with some 44th Street, which is a three weight in the color Pale Aqua. So those two held together. She isn't sure what she wants me to make her yet, but these were the colors that she wanted. So it's what she got. And it's going to be super soft because this is super soft. This is 540 yards. So I did get two of the sparkle, which is 252 each. So... Whatever I make is, there's still going to be this left, like quite a bit of this left over. Anyway, moving on. Um, I got some of these little minis. And I think I want to make pencil pouches with them. So I had her pick out two colors that she liked for pencil pouches. There should be plenty in there for a pencil pouch. Like... If there's not, then I might cry. But, yeah, so these are just the Sugar Wheel Cotton Minis. This color is Milkshake Madness. And this one is Pretties Please. These are both three weights. It's just like the large, you know, the normal size Sugar Wheel Cotton. Um, like the one that I reviewed on my channel. If you haven't seen that, go check it out. I love this yarn in the normal size cakes, so I know that I'll love it in these little minis too. Um, this is 117 yards, 1.76 ounces, it's a three weight. So same thing, just a miniature version and a faster color change. So that's my Hobby Lobby trip. That was my $77. Um, also, my daughter's yarn, the 44th Street cost three dollars for this um and then the i love this yarn with sparkles was 3.49 each the cotton minis were 75 no a dollar 75 each hey kiddo we got package oh we got some mail guys oh you know what I'm going to open this on camera. It has nothing to do with crochet, but it's for my dog. Bruce! Bruce! Come here, big boy! Um, I think this is a matching scrunchie and bandana. Doggy gets the bandana. I get the scrunchie. I get the scrunchie. 
Or she gets the scrunchie. If I even got, I don't know. Maybe I didn't get a matching scrunchie. I may have. No, it doesn't look like I did. So I only, no, I did. Okay. So here's the bandana. Isn't it so cute? And then the scrunchie. Here, Bruce. Let's put your bandana on. Come here. Come here. Oh, you've got such a fat neck. Oh, it's so cute. Look at you. Hold still, please. Ew, have you been slobbering? He is very slobbery. Oh, gross. Ew. <laughs> Look at you with your handsome bandana. Look at that. Daddy's gonna have to see that. Hold on, let me. Bruce. Bruce. Yes. He's so <laughs> handsome. Wait, Paul? Oh, are you gonna put it on his foot? Obviously, stop it. Can you put it on his other one? You can't see it in the camera. Bruce, paw. Nope, not that one. Other paw. Paw. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. Now. now he's got his matching scrunchie and he's licking it. <laughs> so okay, sorry. Anyways, distractions. Um. So yeah, that's everything I got from Hobby Lobby. Um, like. I'm, I'm also going to be posting two other videos. I don't know if I'll post both of them today. I'll probably do at least one today. Be the person your dog thinks you are. That is a good, oh, that's a good life slogan, guys. I am a huge dog person. Be the person your dog thinks you are. 100%. Alright, I'm going to get these other videos uh, filmed. I'm going to go ahead and post this one. And... You guys have a good rest of your day. Like I said, I don't know if I'll post the other two today. I probably will, knowing me. No, I gotta at least hold one out. I don't know. Definitely sharing my Facebook marketplace today. Anyways, talk to you guys in a little bit.